Hi everyone, this is Talk Signals Philippines teaching you how to trade and invest in the Philippine stock market independently. Okay, so the index started strong. It went forming higher highs and higher lows in the earlier hours of trading, but started to lose its grip in the middle of trading. It reached a high of 725.90 and a low of 780. 66.40 before settling at 7886.03 up 18.54 points or 0.24%. The broader all share index is also up 0.22%. Sub indices are mixed. Financials, industrials, and property are up while service, mining, and oil and holding firms are down. Best performing sector is the property sector. So let's take a quick look. Cyber is up 3.92%, but small volume. Araneta is up 2.50% with decent volume. SMPH as well, net foreign buying of 2 million. CPG, we have a net foreign selling of 12.5, but despite that, it was able to gain almost 2%. Meg is also up for the day with a huge 186.9 million in foreign net foreign buying. VLL is also up. Uh, net foreign selling of 4.9 million. Ayala Land is up with net foreign bank of 171 million. FLI as well is up. Primex is also up 0.50%. RLC net foreign selling of 26 million. House is down, but it has a net foreign selling of 1.35 million. BD is also moving lower and lower. BRN also down 1.65%, SLI as well, and Bell down 0.95%. Okay. For the worst performing sector, we have holding firms. Okay, GT Cap is slightly higher. LPZ as well, net foreign selling of 1.1 million. <coughs> SDC is also up the MCI we have a net foreign buying of 37 million AC is also up for the day though it has a huge net foreign selling AEV also net foreign selling JGS it's up 2.41 percent LTG OP uh, MPI Costco and SMC those are our losers most active stock for the day is Eagle, of course, because it's it's the company's IPO debut today. Uh, 967.9 million, a little short of 1 billion. So, stock actually went as high as 16.12 but was not able to hold ground. But at least it closed in green alley. Is also up 464 million and Mega World 375 million for the top gainers. WPI started gaining momentum in the afternoon session. Uh, let's try to see. Five minutes. Yeah, it's in the afternoon session around 2 to 220. Okay. BH is also up, but no volume. Rocks is up. Decent volume, fast as well. Cab, no volume, high. Decent volume, 7.07% up. Ace, ACR, net foreign selling of 4.2 million. Win, and STR. For the losers, we have OPMB, no volume, OPM as well. FGNF, Prim, OV, and GSMI, finally. 6.94% down with decent volume. CEU, MJC, Ati, and Coal has volume 2.6 million, down 3.66%. Value turnover today totaled 8.6 billion. There were 95 advancers, 95 decliners, well, 54 names have been unchanged. Foreigners bought 3.16 billion and sold 2.49 billion worth of, of Philippine equities, resulting in a net foreign buying of 674 million. Dollar peso exchange rate is at 49.793. 
foreign market update. Most are up except Hang Seng. And Shanghai is closed for the day. NSC India is up also for the day. That was your market wrap-up report for May 29, 2017. This is Stock Signals Philippines teaching you how to trade and invest in the Philippine stock market independently.